So the other day, I made a really, really dumb purchase and I bought a car. Its name's Craig. So I wanted to make a video on my car because I would be interested if I was a viewer looking at someone else that had just bought a new car and stuff like that. Uh, I know my prime demographic is like 16 to 24 year olds. And I know a lot of you guys will probably have had this first car purchase experience or are gonna get it soon. So I wanted to make a video on mine, show you guys my car. I'm really, really happy with it. And I'm very thankful to you guys for putting, in, putting me in a position be able to buy a new car i'm very grateful for that um and of course we're really close to 100k so if you would subscribe to the channel it'd mean the world to me uh, i think 100k is definitely the peak goal for me on youtube so if you can help me towards that that'd be absolutely fantastic without further ado i think we just take a spin in it to be honest so i've bought myself a volkswagen t-cross they are like an, they're technically an estate it is the body shape of an suv however not quite an suv I, be honest with you, I am not great with cars, so I won't be able to tell you a whole lot about it. I know that it's only a small engine. It's a one litre, 115 TSI engine, so it's nothing too spectacular, um, as I don't have a full license yet. Uh, I, obviously, I can drive around with people that have, in the UK, you can drive with people that have had a license for three years and are over 21. Um, so what, that's what I've been doing. I've got a driving instructor that I learned from and stuff like that. So just getting used to the car like that, really. But, but no, it's a really, really nice car to be honest. There's a speed bump that you can barely see, which is the worst thing, bane of my life around these roads. So it's a nice car to be honest. Uh, you could easily fit a family in it. Uh, obviously, I've got a wife and four kids, as you guys already know, Sharon and, uh, and, the, and the merry band of, of Haber kids. Um, also, you can also probably sleep in this car. I think I'll be doing that when I can't pay rent anymore. So, you know, in a few weeks probably. So. We've got Apple CarPlay, which is absolutely dope. You can have like everything from your phone synced up to the car, which is incredible, uh, something amazing. We have dials. They are dials, really. Uh, we have a wheel. This thing is what steers the car, if you guys didn't know. Um, so if I was to you know, spin the wheel left, the car would in fact turn left. Uh, and if I were to spin the car right, or spin the wheel right, so, uh, should I say, the car would in fact turn right as well. It has got what are these things called? Indicators? So it's got indicators. Um, oh, it's, you know, basic stuff really. <laughs> so it's got a lot of really cool features, things like adaptive cruise control, which will stop and start the car for me in, in you know, uh, stop and start traffic really. Um, it's got uh, lane assist. So when I'm on motorways and other sort of roads, uh, it will actually steer me into the lane if I start veering out of the lane. Uh, which is absolutely incredible. Really, really useful feature, I feel like. There's also a bit of glass on the road, which I'm a little bit worried about. I probably should have let this guy go past, to be honest, but we're already here. So yeah, it's just a, it's a nice, a smooth drive. It's a lovely car. Uh, I really, really enjoy driving it. Um, obviously, I can't wait now just to pass my driving test and stuff like that, really, to, uh, to be able to drive it on my own. That's one thing that really does excite me. But it's a really, really nice car. And uh, like I said, I'm very grateful for you guys putting me in a position to be able to afford such a lovely, lovely car. Um, I really am grateful for that, boys. And, you know, the 0.2% of girls that do watch me. <laughs> you know, there is a 0.2%, there's a few of you. So if you're wondering what the back openings gets you in life, it gets you a brand new car. So, like I said, it's a Volkswagen T-Cross. Um, they are pretty new. They're, they're, this is a 69 plate. <laughs> so the next part of this video, the wind is going to be ridiculous. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk over the footage uh, and just talk you through sort of the things I want to say, basically. Like I said, the, unfortunately, wind is ridiculous at the minute. It's so windy. If you, you can see out there, our lavender bush is, is so windy right now. You probably can't really see it, but you know what? It's windy, right? Believe me. So in the back, uh, you can actually pull a handle and move the seats forward which allows you for a lot more uh, boot space. Now, I'm a big boy, so I'm gonna get out of the car if I tried right now. However, what I'll do is come behind the camera, I'll get him to move it forward to a point where he can actually still get out, and I'll show you what it does to the boot. So, if we swap and I grab the camera real quick, I'll show you the boot whilst he does that. So this is what it looks like when you sort of slide the seats forward and back, as you see, it opens up more boot space, really. That's about it, but I have my lunchbox of, uh, of cool little cleaning equipment as well. They actually gave me this for free. Massive thank you to uh, to Life Shine for uh, for the hookup. We've got loads of like 
cleaning supplies and stuff like that. By the way, the little dot on the camera on the left hand side, I have no idea what that is and I can't fix it. Thank you all again for, uh, for putting me in a position to be able to get this car. Um, I'm very grateful for the support we've had over the last year, year plus. Um, obviously, you guys know we are really close to 100k, which is crazy. And I'm just, I'm excited. I really am excited. Uh, I'm excited for FIFA 20 coming out. Um, so I'm just excited to sort of get it all done and dusted. Uh, so once again, thank you very much. Uh, let me know down below. If you guys drive, what car you drive in the comments down below. I'd love to hear it. Uh, let me know kind of what make, what model, if you want. You can put the year on it as well. If you want to flex, you've got like a Lambo Hurricane 2019 like NEP, then you can uh, you can flex that down in the, in the comments down below. But best thank you once again. Um, Yankee Candle, not a sponsor, but I recommend that if you want to make your car smell nice. And uh, who knows, maybe we'll do some driving videos. Let me know down below if you want to see that. Thank you to Tom as well, Nerdfire, for uh, for manning the camera. He's, uh, he's behind the camera right now. <laughs> and I'll, uh, I'll see you later.